We wanted people to understand, like, you don't have to sacrifice family mm -hmm. for success. Like, you become successful because of family. Yep. You use them as a reason as opposed to a work-life balance excuse. Yep. You know, so and so, a friend of mine would ask me, you know, doesn't your, you know, you need to be at home with your daughter? And I would always respond, I'd say, yeah, 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 like my daughter needs me now. You know, she's two, she's almost two, but you know when she's really gonna need me? When she's like eight, or when she's 12, or when she's 16. That's when she's really gonna need me. And what can I build over the next five years? What can I accomplish over the next five years? and set myself up to be more free then. Which is just a joke, it's just a freaking joke. And man, I'm so happy, quite frankly, that I've figured this out now. I've had seasons over the last two years of, of having my daughter where I've been extremely career focused and used it as an excuse, is like I've, I've, I've gotta, focus on the career even harder because now I've got a daughter. And then there's been seasons and, and, and months in those two years where I've been super focused at home Whoa. because I've got a daughter. It's not just about you, you know, mm. it's about your family now and, and what's best for them. And, and to me, that's been a huge motivator. It's been a huge motivator um, in order to succeed in business, knowing that you've got a lot more at stake uh, now. And because of the intentional focus on those priorities of putting family first, even on vacation, I was able to enjoy it so much more. I didn't have that feeling of guilt as though I was behind on something, as though that time that I was spending was taking away from, from something else productive that I quote unquote should be doing. But each of us have our own world, right? That's exactly right. And and for us, our family is our world. And so our family is the one that deserves our best. They deserve our best. But what I've realized in the last month, literally the last month, is that I've been putting all of you first, myself second, and my family third. And I'm a good salesman. So I had sold myself real hard on it, and I had sold her even harder. On it. And so she was, she was pretty bought in, but I have a feeling that I had about 18 months, maybe, maybe two years left before I would have burned everything to the ground. And this realization that I now have that like, I really don't care about you guys at all. I care about me and her, and that's it. And it's only from the overflow of that that can really provide any value to you to begin with. Yes. And, and so I just want to say thank you for hanging in here. Love you. I've always been like focused on where things are going and what will happen when I get there and being able to do these types of things when I get there. But now realizing that like you may not ever get there. <laughs> so you have to enjoy the time that you have now and make the absolute most out of every minute that you have, uh, especially with your loved ones.